Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I got myself into this situation. Well, it all started two days ago when my mom woke me up for school. <laughs> alright, 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 you get the picture. Okay, enough of the bullshit. Hello everybody, my name is Augustine Lennon Jr. I have been making movies since I was about 7 years old. I've made over 199 videos on YouTube as of right now, and today that number changes to 200. And what is the 200th one? You're watching it right now. This is how I make my movies, how I edit my movies, and why I make my movies. My 200th video special on my, how my career started. I was born on January 7th, 2003, about 19 years ago. I was born in an abandoned hospital that reopened years later as a mental institution. During that time, my mother was a waitress from Marie Callender's and my father was a gunnery sergeant in the United States Marine Corps. Growing up, when I was a kid, I used to watch a lot of movies from the 70s, 50s, 80s, and 90s. Hell, I even grew up watching Charlie Chaplin films, Fatty Arbuckle films, and even silent movies that sadly nobody else remembers except me. And I remember growing up watching all of this thinking, I could actually make this type of stuff. It wasn't until my dad had a yellow, not a yellow colored, I forgot, it was because it was saturated white. A silver-esque small digital camera that I usually used to make small little videos with, with action figures and stuffed animals. One big one I did was with a stuffed gorilla from my grandma's house called Blue Monkey when I was only 8 years old. However, sadly, the movie to this day is a lost film. When I first started editing my movies, the first thing I did was a app on a phone called Video Shop Video Editor. It was good, but most of the editing came out a little bit like this. Oh, Yanbon. I didn't expect you to be here. To be honest, VideoShop wasn't the first app I used. The very first app was a small stop motion app that was uh, to promote this one Minecraft set when Minecraft was in its heyday, its main prime when it first came out. There was a little figure set where you put up a camera and you can do stop motion with little Minecraft figures. Here is a video of a stop motion animation I did with the Minecraft app. After that, I usually switched to Stop Motion Studio, a really high quality, well sorta of high quality, uh, film app where I can do stop motion at a limited amount, well, minus the storage space on my phone. Anyways, when I make my movies, I usually edit them with small amounts of detail. Like right here, when I press, I press a little bit of the audio, and I move it upwards. And then move it a little bit downwards to synchronize with the film itself. Sometimes, to be honest, making movies is hard. But, when you put a little passion into it, it's a little bit good. And... Like Johnny Depp once said in a Tim Burton film, Filmmaking is not about the tiny details, it's about the big picture! Well, I hope you all enjoyed this. Now, let's have a look at the finished product of the reptilian ghoul.
party like a flip for life party Cause a flip for life party don't stop So throw your hands in the air ladies if you don't care Cause a flip for life party gon' pop If you're getting drunk up in the club you gon' get If you're getting lifted off the bed you gon' get If you can't rip the party up you gon' get Come on ladies, come on ladies